Hey, what do you say? It's OBC TV and it's Kevin and Rick. Rick's back. Back back from Alaska. You want to hear about it? Come talk to me. Yeah, he's got stories. You don't stories. want to hear about it? Come talk to me. He's got stories. Come on over to the Outlaw Brewing Company. Hear Rick's stories along with numerous other things that are going on beginning tomorrow, Thursday, all the way straight through to uh, Mother's Day on Sunday. Yeah, it's going to be a crazy busy weekend. Last weekend, you guys all remembered, when it's beautiful out, this is the place to be, and this place was packed. So uh, I thank everybody for coming out. Yeah, it was it was really nice to see uh, everyone here on, on, on Saturday and on Sunday. And we have a lot planned uh, beginning tomorrow. I mean, this is great. If you are a lover of dogs, okay, if you're a dog lover, dog owner, uh, tomorrow night's trivia, which starts at 6 o'clock right here at the Outlaw Brewing Company, it's all about dogs. It's all about dogs. Yep. Uh, Heather from... Uh, Paw Prints Photography. Hold on, I got the... He's got the cheat sheet. I got it right here. Yep. Yes, Heather from Paw Prints Dog Photography. Trivia all about dogs. All about dogs. Yep. She, uh, she was here for um, the Adopt a Dog uh, Humane Society thing uh, oh, just, yeah. just last week. Doing, okay, yep. um, Some dog photos. I'm sure you've seen some photos of her dogs uh, at the Outlaw. She loves coming here and uh, the dogs love coming here too. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And uh, you know, on the subject of dogs, we are going to have the canine keg pull competition spring version coming up uh, not this Sunday, Mother's Day, but a week from Sunday. Yes. So just keep that. More dogs. Yeah, more dogs. But just a little aside. And then, and then get this, all right, for you trivia crazed people. More trivia on Friday night here at the Outlaw. This is something special. This one's super cool. Um, if you remember back, rewind back to last August when we were at the Wyman Tavern Brew Fest. Okay. Outlaw puts on a great show, right? We brought our tap truck. We did that whole thing. But yeah, I yeah. said, we're going to brew a beer at a brew fest and serve it as a fundraiser for the uh, Historic Society. So our, our good friend uh, Bryce from Ashwillet Brewing Company, no longer open, but still he went there and uh, brewed a batch of beer. It's a uh, a pecan porter. Wow. Uh, we've been aging it. Bryce is good people. He I is like that good guy. good people. He is, uh, and he's a great brewer. So uh, that beer is now ready and we're gonna put it on tap on Friday night. And Alan Rumrell um, is gonna come and do trivia. On from, Friday night. Yep, yep. And he's from the Historic Society. It's going to be local history, general history, cool. and uh, geography. Yeah. All right. And what's the prize if you win on uh, Friday night? Well, there'll be prizes um, each round, so like our regular trivia. But the, the, the grand prize for first place is two tickets to uh, the Brewfest this year. That pecan porter. Um, how many uh, kegs of that do you have? Ah, uh, there's only one keg in that thing. One? Yeah, there's only probably about one? 45 pints and every penny for 45 pints? Yep, so you better get here and, um... And it's available beginning on Friday? Just on Friday. All right, you heard that, right? I heard that. That is oh, super yeah, limited. Me. Wow. Yep, so it's, uh... That yep, is super limited. And all the money goes to the Historic Society. They have some great programs. Um, I think one of their taglines is find your place in history. Okay. Um, yeah. Love it. It's important. So coming up uh, on the weekend, we actually start to uh, acknowledge the moms on Saturday. Yes, uh, so our uh, Mother's Day market, Becca has been working really hard to, to bring some vendors in um, and put kind of a little, um, little market Crafters. Here. Crafters, yep. jewelry, um, candles. flowers, candles, natural skin care, flowers, and more. And more. Yeah, I'm waiting for the more. I'm going to figure out what the more <laughs> is. Uh, shop for someone yourself or bring someone to pick out what they like. That's going to happen on Saturday throughout the day. And then uh, everyone's favorite, Heath Lewis, is going to be here too. Yep, Heath plays uh, at 5 o'clock outside. Yep. It's finally outside music. and uh, Songs about mothers. Yes, all, all about mothers. Yep, every single song yep. sung by Heath Lewis about moms on Saturday yep. night. Yep, ask him for a mom song when he comes. <laughs> <laughs> He's been practicing. I've been listening. He's been practicing. No, he hasn't. So... <laughs> The Mother's Day market continues, actually, on Mother's Day on Sunday. Bring Mom to the Outlaw Brewing Company for a pint for something delicious from the Outlaw Kitchen. Yes, absolutely. And uh, we'll have a, something special on the truck for Mom, too. So um, just stop on by. We'll, we have a little more information. Basically, we don't know what it is, but we're going to figure it out. Well, face painting on Sunday. I oh, see yeah, here. yeah. So... Uh, fudge, jewelry, games, and a lot more. The forecast, again, looks really good. Mm -hmm. So, you know, you know, Mom wants to come to the Outlaw. Yeah. We know this. So bring her on over. 
either on Saturday or on Sunday uh, and enjoy live music on Sunday. This uh, just started up this past Sunday, live music on Sunday afternoons. This goes all the way through to October. Yeah, we had our good friend Eric Turner. You know, we always talk about the Southern connection. We've got somebody that has some talent that comes up. And uh, Eric came up from Chattanooga, Tennessee to play for us. He did a fantastic job. Uh, and he'll be back later this fall. Nice. Um, you know, live music uh, is a really important ingredient to what we do here. And do you happen to notice that big sign on the on the barn there? I noticed that yeah. big sign on the barn. Yeah. But very very uh, special date and event as yep. well. Kevin climbed the ladder and hung that thing while I was nice gone. Nice job. Good cool job. car, Kevin. Yep, yep. If you've so, ever seen him on a ladder, it's not pretty. <laughs> so this Sunday, the live music, uh, if you, you know, you, you're thinking, oh, there's nothing going on on a Sunday afternoon. Live music here at the Outlaw, Scott Allen Savoy. Yep. who uh, performed here at the Outlaw Brewing Company last year. He returns this Sunday afternoon from 2 until 5. 2 until 5. So the little sign behind us is Wink Fest. It is sold out. Nice. Nice. Bad news for some, great we news We told for you others. this was going to happen. Yep. And uh, it's a very limited ticket sales. We wanted to make sure it was a, um, a very... Um, small event small enough to be uh, enjoyable so it's not a huge crowd and uh, just just the way we like to do it here maybe it won't be the only event uh we may plan some more maybe but in the uh, if you li listen to wink country you can win tickets they do have a few tickets left to win through over the next few weeks all right 98.7 on the fm dial hey good to have you back man hey it's great to be back you know alaska was fun it was um the most beautiful landscape i've ever seen my wife brought me on a, a wonderful trip trip and uh if you ever get a chance to see Alaska, do it. It is it is really something special. Hey, man. This is OBC TV. Cheers. You talk a lot. You get six and a half you minutes. You did a good job holding that it, camera.